Welcome to the sport where the laziest go to get paid. Today, we've got a spectacular event for you. A few days ago, Mr. DC Gay reported to make a wager of $10,000 betting on his own bowling ability. Some would say that's a stupid decision. Others would say he doesn't have $10,000. But anyone with common sense would say both parties are correct. Here is the event of the $10,000 bowl. You know, every time I spend time with him, I want to kill myself. So, how are you feeling prior to the game? How are you feeling? I mean, like... I won the last one, of course, so, you know, I'm coming in no, strong with this. I mean, if you think back... If you, you didn't win the last one. I mean, if you think further back. Interesting. Interesting thoughts. Like, when we were three, when, when we were three, and we played, like, that 10-pin bowling with the little plastic things. I don't know. And, like, got that one strike. Anything to say? Those idiots. Ah. Mate, I'll beat my meat and beat them at the same time. You heard that, right? I won't lie to you, my mind just went blank at that point. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I love how, like, with us two, you could just improvise the interview. And we said funny shit. Lash is just sitting there, like. <laughs> Use your words. Okay, say the question again. What was the question? What was the question? Say again. Uh, how was... Okay. <clears throat> how were you feeling prior to the game? I felt very uh, good. I felt strong. This is some like French oral. <laughs> you know, like the listening, the speaking exam. This how the... I felt very good. Last weekend I went to the cinema. So we officially get into the first bowl of the game. Obviously, we're gonna start off strong with oh fucking hell, come on. Let's aim for the rest of the pins now. And how have those pins stayed up standing? Seems like even hitting the pins won't help this man. So he's leaving. Oh, he's leaving. Oh dearie. He's got Lasher on the ball. Lines up the bowl nicely, and that's a beautiful hit from the man in black. No Will Smith this time. And takes the spare with amazing precision, but I have to say. What is with this arm movement? Next up to the table is Dre. Goes for it with by far the shittest technique so far, but somehow it sort of works, of course. Yep, bowlers everywhere have got their head in their hands. And of course he even gets a spare. Okay, uh, it's an illegal bowl, but when have I not done anything illegal? Mr. DC Gay with a good bowl following Andreas. Know, what was that about you doing stuff illegal? Skipping forward halfway through the game, the scores were looking pretty tight. Bowl after bowl after bowl. Skipping forward even more, because we don't like consistency, we found ourselves at the tip of the climax. The last shot. Yes, that euphemism was intentional. One shot, one ball. I think it's time to check with the casting couch. I mean, the bowlers. Once again. He's stressed. It's looking bad. You can see what I hope to be sweat dripping off his face. He readies the shot. Lines it up nicely. And goes! There it is! He has done it! The black man wins at sports once again! Oh, how times have not changed! It's beautiful to see, but it has been done! Mr. Gay will retain his $10,000 and live to pay another rent! <laughs> Let's have a little check-in on how the bowlers felt in that final play of the game. Low scorer? Yeah, okay. Uh, how does yeah. it feel? You know what? Start off great. It didn't. It didn't start great. You know what? I had like one or two good shots. That's the only rest one. To the right hit. Yeah. There's like 20 shots. I hit like two. Uh, any new tat to take no, for next time? No. Do you want to try? I just. I got 93. Uh, you got 91. Yes. Final school mm -hmm. in that game, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, was. what's your feeling on that? Well, it was quite disappointing. Uh, I'm not gonna lie to you, because especially listening to you. Oh. A man like you. Skillful, what do you mean by that, Lasha? A skillful man. A man like him. You didn't lose to me. Him. You know, we prevail, you know, and in the end, it was, it was a good game, I guess. It was a good shot at the end, finally, from, from you. Again, if I really wanted to, you know, try, if I really attempted, 
It would have been easy, but but it, there's no fun in that. So follow up question: You're <laughs> claiming you didn't try. I, at moments I did. The moments I didn't. You know. Sounds a lot like you did the whole time. Sounds a lot like you tried. At moments I did. At moments I did. Sounds. Like, I'm translating that to I whooped your ass. Yeah. We both have two wins. All we need is one more to realize who the win is. Okay. We're going to bowling um, again tomorrow. The only person who really got whooped. Luke was last, Lasher was second, and I was first, right? Mm-hmm. So, um, you were there. I was there. What? Well, I mean, all I've got world. to say yeah, is it's better than like Trinidad did in the last World Cup. That's like, I, I was third, and you were what, like, uh, like 56? We weren't in the last World yeah, Cup. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Doesn't sound so great, is it? Bringing back some painful memories. <laughs> Who's the interviewer now? Uh. <laughs> uh, anything you'd like to say to the youth them out there about bowling? The future of the bowling community? The youth them? I mean, like, I just don't want to look like an idiot while bowling. If you go bowl, so like you. you invite a girl to go bowling with you. So like you. You, you. you throw the ball and it's just shit. It goes in the gutter every time by Lucas. So like, so like you. It's just, it's just sad. So like you. Luca. And final question, uh, anything more to say to the youth them out there? Let's not mutes. <laughs> of them dents. <laughs> this is serious. Bowling. <laughs> it's not for the week. Ain't for the week. Ain't. If you're weak, get out. Get out if you're weak. I don't want you. I don't want you to go near a ball. Be the I, bowler, not the bowling ball. Y- y- people will <laughs> use you instead during bowling if you're that weak. They might as well pick you up. Didn't you play bowling today, though? But I, we, can I beat you? Okay. So, back to my message. <laughs> if you suck, get out. Don't even bother practicing, because you're going to stay like that. You're going to be poo. Doo-doo water. All right? You're going to stay like doo-doo water. If you're naturally good, great. You stay there. You better be better than others, because if you're not doo-doo water, get out. I don't want you. So only the best ever bowler should ever best. bowl. Which is only one person. So that one person, me. Well, that'd be the one then, because if he beat you. But that means you're. Uh, uh, so, but does that mean you're do do order? Because if he beat you, then you're do do order. I let him beat me. You know, anything you say after that point is just going to be cut off. Like, we're just going to end it with a you do do order. <laughs> it's my and then we're going to edit it so that you nod. And then we're going to move on. So, wait, so in conclusion, you're a do do order. You're a do do order. No, you're a do do order. Then you. Do do. You are what you eat. Did I just hear three people say call each other doo-doo for 10 minutes? <laughs> Is that what I heard? <laughs> yeah, I've seen it.